Oh gosh. Yeah. Just upsetting the locals. Squish click appersand is that Amy Chan. How many ant how many Anticans have you murdered for them to react like that? Many. <laughs> Probably a lot more Tonberry, though. Yeah, those are the only ones that seem to matter. <laughs> I mean, what do they have to complain about? All the other beast, all the other like beasties and fiends get killed just as much. What makes them so special? Ah, oh, I forget these guys do petrify. Blech. Should be doing some buffs or some uh yeah some buffs and some enfeebs. Like bio. I don't know why, but every time I'm subjobbing black mage, I keep forgetting that yeah, I'm subjobbing black mage. <laughs> oh, good timing. Good timing. Alrighty. Dem AoE attacks. More dungeon crawling. Your with my buddy Marin. Yeah. And my imaginary fiance. <laughs> Books if you don't have them. I'm from Little Blue Fox, dude. Or a book if you don't have. Oh, hello, Beetle. Oh, you Beetle's not aggro. Okay. Oh, good. I thought you were getting aggroed. Yeah, Beetles are fine. <laughs> we I do have a tendency to run around corners here and get aggroed, though, so. I've, I vaguely remember this place from the old days. There's another beetle. There's an Antiguan. Okay, I have a map for here. These guys are EP negative negative. Okay. I'm just grabbing my uh, my book buffs. Yeah, you're good. I still got some from earlier. Boop, 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 beep, boop. It's nice that your summoner is, kind of, is uh, finally getting experience on these excursions. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, these guys are showing up as EP for me. Yeah. Um, okay. Do I have any markers here? Ah, uh, fucking don't. Okay, so for uh, the... If I remember right, we go to the left, I think. Go straight here, straight through here, and then... So the... So the... Hey, you know, we're gonna have to get some of these no matter what. So for the teleport Altep quest, the, uh... Stone Fragment spawns at three places on map one, two places on map two. Okay. So I yeah. see where map two is. And then uh, for Headstone Pilgrimage, we have to go to for the for the actual mission mission. Um, drop down through the sand pit at K six, and then head at, head east to re-enter Altepa Desert. Okay, let me mark that. Markers. Uh, sand pit is over here. Did you catch any aggro from these guys, or...? Uh, I didn't get close enough. Oh, okay. It doesn't look like we're catching aggro. Although, to be fair, Rage Cat and I only ran by one of them. Okay, sand pit. I've got that marked. Um, okay. Your, uh... Oh yeah, it looks like it's a very distinct. Oh, yeah, I'm casting aggro. Oh, you are. Yeah. I'm coming. Bitch stunned me. Fuck you, buddy. Oh. I'm coming. I'm good. Oh uh, yeah. I wasn't worried about this. Oh, Carby took them off me. We gonna do, got... We gonna make it rain, yeah. holy spells. Banishka Sentinel combo is awesome when you can actually get it off. <laughs> yes. Throw up all the shiny auras. Rage Cat, aim for the big ant butt. You can't miss it. <laughs> 
That that is a huge butt. Oh, I was about to cast a spell too. You bitch. What? Silence. I oh. literally just clicked. It was like bloop blah. You're silenced. Oh yeah, I'm silenced too. That sucks. Yeah, for two freaking minutes. Antikins, I only have one very important thing to tell you. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. We gonna get you. That's not being able to heal kind of sucks. Okay, now I can heal. <clears throat> Forgot I can have Kirby heal too. There you go. All right, Rage Cat. Dick kick combo, ready? Oh, wait, save it for the next one. I'm moving over to the next one specifically. Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> Dick kick combo coming up. Oh, yeah. Nice. That is beautiful. That is a match made in heaven. Ah, that, is straight out of, that is straight out of Altana's backyard. <laughs> That piece of rotten meat that dropped sure isn't, though. There we go. Okay, for your, um... Ow. Um... Teleport scroll. What What were we doing? Um, for the teleport scroll quest that I flagged in Rubble. Mm -hmm. Um, for that one, the missing tablet piece that they're looking for, it spawns either on map one in H6... I'm just going to type it in the party chat for reference. H6, okay. H10, E9, and then map 2 is D9 and L11. Hmm. I bet you it's going to be in that spot we can't get to. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah this is one of those, door. this is one of those doors this door where here. you need a certain job to stand on it, or? I don't think so, but I do think you need some kind of... I'm really liking the uh, Zillart music. I know you have. I changed my dad's. <laughs> yeah, I know you have dads and stuff set up, but I'm enjoying I it. I have. I have Final Fantasy. Is it Final Fantasy Eight? I don't remember now. Oh yeah, I one don't for actually this area, have eh? access to the rest of my music anymore. Yeah, because you lost a whole bunch of music when your computer needed work, eh? It, yeah, it was my external hard drive. It, right, uh, right, right, right. It might have gotten bumped while I was moving or something, but yeah, it reformatted itself. Everything is gone. So I've been recollecting all that re very slowly but surely. I haven't even started on my video game list yet. I'm still going down my anime list. Yeah, it's fair. <laughs> I literally have. <laughs> so I have an entire day's worth, like 300 some odd different songs of initial D Eurobeat stuff mm -hmm. alone. Oh, wow. And then for the last, that took me three weeks. And then for the last, like, two, about that same time, two and a half, three weeks, I've been going down my uh, anime list, you know, A through Z. I'm going through B's. So, per the proper title, I'm on Sailor Moon. I have twice as much Sailor Moon music. I okay. literally have a day and a half straight playtime worth of Sailor Moon music. A day and a half. A day and a half. Of just Sailor Moon music. Of straight Sailor Moon music. That's... Between the, between the, the classic series, um, the, the following sagas, uh, a couple of anniversary concert albums, and the Sailor Moon Crystal soundtracks. Damn. There, I, I never knew that there was quite that much. Like, I had maybe half of it previously. Well, that show's been going for a long time, eh? I remember that show being on... I mean, the... English dubbed censored version being on yeah. when I was like nine. Yeah, it was uh, yeah. Um, the class classic series was. I know this. 
I know this. Oh, did we go the... I think we went Last the wrong series, way. series, 92. So down in the quicksand pit we go. All right, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll come back and try that one again sometime. I'll do a little yeah. more research. Uh, hey, there's a three question mark point right here. Is this one of the places? I don't know. Nothing out of the ordinary. Oh, okay. Uh, we're gonna have to fight something. More pages. All the progress. Oh my god, targets. There we go. Well, then again, like, I'm a huge Dragon Ball fan, and that's been going since, like, the 80s. Like, the, uh... The Boo Saga, yeah, I, had... I think, wrapped up in, like, 95. Uh, yeah, sounds about right. Um, I remember watching, uh, I had Sailor Moon and DBZ back-to-back -back on Toonami in the late 90s. Mm-hmm. And I loved both, so... Yeah. I was one of those freaks. <laughs> that liked both sides of the spectrum. <laughs> One thing I hated about Dragon Ball Z up in Canada was, like, originally the old, old, like, the Saiyan Saga, the Namek Saga, they were done by Ocean right? Dub. And mm -hmm. Ocean Dub, I think, was a... I'm not sure if they were a Canadian-based company or not. But um, mm. but they, they did the old stuff, and then Funimation did their stuff. And we had the Funimation stuff. It was edited, like like horrifically yeah. edited. But we had the um, Funimation stuff for a while. From Frieza to about mid-Cell Games arc. And then yep. they just decided randomly to go back to... Uh, go back to Ocean Dub. Oh, and that's it, like, annoying. And it like threw everybody off. Because now it was like different voice actors and... Yeah. It was like a weird like last minute. It was like right before they defeated Cell too. It was like a weird last minute decision. Dude, have you seen um any of the uh remake DBZ Kai? I've seen bits and pieces of it. I don't have the discs for it. But um but I have seen bits and pieces of it, yeah. Oh, it's so good. It is pretty good, yeah. I've only seen up through uh the end of the Cell saga though. They've yeah. since gone up through... I think they ended on the Boo Saga? Yeah, they did. It was up I in the air. That, it was yeah. up in the air for a while whether they even they were even going to do the Boo Saga. But I think fans were kind of kind of clamoring for it. Dude, yeah, I was so hoping, and I, I actually just recently found out that they did. Because yeah. I didn't even know they were continuing it. But yeah, then I saw it the other day while I was going through my anime list, and I was like, <gasps> Yes! <laughs> yeah. They went through. They went through the boost. Over. One thing I really loved about Dragon Ball Super, they had um, they had like this tiny little filler arc, like ooh, only. Ooh, don't only... tell me nothing. I haven't seen it yet. Oh, it, it's like a filler arc. I, I I won't tell you exactly what happens, but uh, they had like this tiny little filler arc, and they actually brought back one of the Ocean Dub voice actors to reprise, ooh. kind of sort of reprise their old role. Oh, that's cool. And the arc itself was kind of not that great mm. but with the English dub I really enjoyed that because I was like isn't that so and so and I was like oh it totally is they like totally just were like hey come come reprise your role of a character that you used to voice in Ocean Dub that's awesome uh, Mr. Pierso was petrified yeah I was um for Sailor Moon Crystal, that's why one reason why I was so excited for it because the uh, the original artist actually was directly involved. So they went back to uh, much closer to her original manga art style and whatnot. Oh, did somebody else eventually take over the art for it, or? Uh, well, no, just for the the anime adaptation of the manga. Oh. Um, uh, yeah, they had you know changed the style and whatnot, you know, because the animators, it's it's. Uh, different than initially drawing it so yeah somebody was doing the art instead you know still her story and whatever but so for the remake they actually had her come back and they did it closer to her style and stuff oh that's cool yeah I mean like if you um, if you were to look at um, most notably if you were to look at classic season one uh, right next to the remake season one like you, there's massive difference in the art style. Oh, that's cool. And the, the coloring too. The coloring was different 
um, uh, in the, uh, mm, I'm trying to avoid, um, oh, it's right in the middle of the room. We're going to have to fight some of these guys. You know what? what? We might as well just, just, <laughs> get him. <laughs> Waiting for this, like, profound plan. Just get him. <laughs> just get him. <laughs> yes. Clear the room. Yep. As well. We are it's, here they're to. All, throw... They're all just gonna link us anyway. <laughs> we are here to throw the fuck down. I'm getting itchy. I don't know what's making me itchy. Did you bring your basil like ointment? <laughs> Asking for a friend. Uh, I might have to go get my lavender though. That's my arms. That's something. Something in the air. Something's irritating my arms. It could just be because the air is different wouldn't later that, at night. Wouldn't that be memorable? This was the episode where <laughs> Marin <laughs> had some kind of allergic reaction to, <laughs> to bad shrimp. <laughs> oh god, I am so glad I I like I don't actually have any allergies that I know of. Yeah. I mean, like I do have some weird reactions to certain things, but. Um... I don't. I don't think it's allergy per se. I think it's just things like sometimes my stomach just doesn't agree with stuff and whatnot. That's fair. But anxiety does that a lot too. I remember I had this one friend in high school. I haven't talked to her in years. She had like a deathly bad allergy to peanuts. Oh no. Yeah, like her throat would close up and stuff. And you know, kid kids, yeah, that's high school kids shit. are just mean. Oh and, like, yeah. The, oh the, god, somebody didn't put peanuts in her stuff, did they? Oh, there were there were a couple of kids when I was in high school that were um throwing like oh Henry bars at her and stuff. Oh no. And I was like very much like a stick up for the underdog and very protective yeah. of my friends. So I went in and this this kid that was throwing oh Henry bars at her was like half my size. And I go in and I'm like, which of you little shits was fucking throwing O. Henry bars at my friend? The whole room just went quiet. Like I was pissed. And, oh, yeah. and this kid was like, what are you going to do about it? I picked him up, dragged him out into the hall, and I almost put his head through a friggin' locker. Oof. I was kind of an angry teenager. Like I'm not condoning that kind of violence, but oh, yeah. I was mad. Well, yeah, I, I mean, that could have fucking killed your friend. That's that's serious shit. Yeah, and I mean, like, they were in the wrapper and stuff too. But like, but it's like, it's it's disrespect. It's, it's just yeah, yeah, it's it's disrespectful. Like, it's downplaying a very serious issue. Very. Yeah. Okay. Do we just all the stories, that? kids? Don't yeah. be a dick. Do not be. Yeah. That's... Especially in such a case where you could yep. literally kill someone. Hey, uh, Marin. Yo. 5,000 gil if you go first. <laughs> Fixing my markers, man. <laughs> Alright, I'll take the plunge. Well, I'll, I'll wait till you're done because you got an antic in like right to your right to your 9 o'clock there. Oh, baby. And, oh, yeah, I heard him. Yeah. I heard him. Rage has got it. You can't get back up here, though. Mm. It's all good. Don't worry, Rage has got it. Look, oh, my. Oh, wow. That was a lot. I have never been so turned on by Seven, watching a woman... 95. I've never been so turned on by watching a woman kick something. <laughs> yeah, I'm up. do my happy dance. Oh, boy. Oh, that is a blue case. Of I'm just going to wave from it? down here and be left out. You're doing great, Amy Chan. <laughs> Damn right, I am, bitch. <laughs> and drop down. We Shut go. up, Pierce. So you're in the hole. You're Wee! dead to us. Oh, my. Oh, that is cool. Oh, oh no. Ah! no. <laughs> All right. Where are we? We are still on the first map. We're just under. Okay. Well... We didn't die. No nope. progress. <laughs> nope. <laughs> There's some fire. Hello. Hello, Cactar that oh no. Hey. Oh, he's EP. Just watch out for a thousand needles. What's your problem? You'll survive that, I will not. These cactors have like little man syndrome to the extreme. Yeah, they do. 
Picture them having like a Ninja Turtle voice. <laughs> I like the little squeaks they do. What? I love it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh. Oh yeah. Oh no! I saw that pop on the screen. He's preparing thousand needles. I was like, oh god, no! I'm gonna die. You can have that elixir in there. Yeah, that could that that might have hurt. Oh, we got another one up here. Look at him run. I love them. They are so cute. Their their bodies are like w weird, like weirdly I shaped. Shape. I love their shape. They kind of remind me of that uh, Oogie Boogie from the Night Nightmare Before Christmas. Yes. He was very pear shaped. Mm-hmm. Pear shaped. Oh, I thought that was photosynthesis. Okay, he's fine. Targets! Uh, it doesn't matter now. Okay. Oh my god, this reminds me of turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Turtles in a half shell. Turtle power. Yeah, man. You know what? I never actually got to watch Ninja Turtles. That's sad. I got to watch a little bit of it. One of my cousins was super into it. That was like one of his favorite shows. Yeah. And like, I remember getting to watch a few episodes with him at some point. But like, that's literally all I've ever gotten, gotten to see. So that was like literally the very beginning of this year. It's like literally only got to see like the first few episodes. You could probably watch all of them on YouTube now. Oh, you know, probably. I mean, it's such an old cartoon, I doubt anybody cares. <laughs> but I don't know. Okay. We made it. All right. As we go on, we remember all the shit we've been through together. Go find some Antiquans. Here we go. Oh shit, that one's a black mage. Oh, it's gonna hurt. He's casting flood. No, I'm fucking running, bitch. Uh. Okay. I just shield dashed okay. him. <laughs> Thank you. I think you were far enough away, but. Yeah, I, I managed to get rid of it. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Back again. Tell a friend. Yeah. Oh, gosh. I hit the disengage button by accident. Pfft, noob. <laughs> nah, I still do it on accident occasion. Oh, yeah. Just when you think you have this interface mastered, you, you, you fuck something <laughs> up. Yup. Happens to me all the time. Alrighty. That one's casting blaze spikes. Okay, he's good. Keep going. This way. Ah. Oh no, I have gravity. Oh, Slow really? That's not good. motion marching through the desert. Damn. Gravity, thou art a heartless bitch. What? <gasps> Wait, that's a ruby column. Are we... Oh. Is it in here? What a bitch! Oh wait, he didn't even aggro. What? Ha! Oh, ha. Too late. I was, was clear. I was ready. It was clear who I started was... that fight. <laughs> Watch, he's like... <laughs> but he's also a caster, so maybe that's why. Watch, he was like the one Antikin that, like, sympathized with the allied races and was trying to foster peace between the races. <laughs> like, me feel bad. Like that Thick Blix goblin. <laughs> oh, I love Thick Blix. I did too. I was sad to see how he went out. I mean, yeah. kind of saw it coming, but... Yeah. Okay, so after zoning, K6, Western El Tepa Desert, drop down and follow the below ground level path tunnel to H9. 
and touch the headstone. Yes, that's where we're heading. Okay, I was just checking the guide to make sure. I Seriously, every time I don't check, I end up missing something. And then I go, why didn't I just check the damn guide? It's like being too stubborn to ask for directions. Oh, hello, Antique and Pally. You can't be the Pally. I'm the Pally. He's a Pally. Damn it. Don't make me kick your ass. Let's do some of that. Skill chain love. Cause we got keyboard chemistry. Oh yeah. Girl, I love the way you ninja kick. Oh. Wait. Oh, I thought he was gonna aggro you. He like suddenly turned towards you and then he just stopped. Nah, they did that. There you go. Stupid bug man. I Here's don't... Oh, perfect. I don't think this one has a boss fight. Because they have them in the guide, they have them separated between, like, fights and no fights. Yeah. You've attained an, an earth fragment. You now have all eight fragments of light. Woohoo! 